This is Bill Carroll for Zenny 62 Sports Media, and I'll be giving some scouting notes on some particular players that I've been watching, uh, both before and, of course, during the HBCU Legacy Bowl here in beautiful New Orleans, Louisiana, and it'll be taking place, of course, uh, the game itself will be on the 19th, 3 p.m. Uh, Eastern, no, 3, 3 p.m. Central, 4 p.m. Eastern, at Yulman Stadium on the campus of beautiful Tulane University. And... Once again, I'm going to admit my bias right up front. I am a graduate of Norfolk State University. I was a student athlete at Norfolk State University. But if you ask anyone who's been down here, and of course, even at East West Shrine Game, Sean Dixon from Norfolk State has helped himself a great deal. He's 6'4", he's 251 pounds. He has 33 and a half inch arms, which in case you don't know, that's long. Those are very long arms. Uh, Average is right around 32, so he's an inch and a half above sort of the average at the position. And things you can't help but like about him. Uh, he has a great motor. You can tell he's been well coached. He's been working out with Chuck Smith, and it shows. Uh, he can rush from basically any one of the pass rush positions. He can rush standing up. He can put his hand in the dirt and even kick inside a little bit. I mean, obviously, you don't do it too much for a 251-pound guy. He could put on another 15 to 20 pounds. 20 might be a bit much, but... I think 12 to 15 pounds is certainly doable if you wanted him to get bigger. I don't think he needs to, especially if you end up playing him as a 3-4 outside linebacker. Other things to note, uh, heavy hands, like I said, good technique. He has uh, not just those initial moves, but he has counters. He can put moves together, he can stack moves. Once again, working with Chuck Smith has helped. And last but not least, uh, when he talks about who his favorite players to watch are, the first person he mentions is Shaquille Barrett. And that's you know, nails it because that's who he plays like. And I think he has a, a potential to be that kind of player at the next level. I'll be giving you some reports on two or three other individual players as we go forward.